What is going on crack addicts? Welcome back to the channel. Now in today's video, I'm gonna be posting a wide variety of chiropractic adjustments from some of your favorite chiropractors, some of the most loved ones and most well-known on YouTube. So that's what you're gonna be seeing in today's video with some new additions also. All of their links will be in the description. That's where you can check them out directly. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button to the channel and make sure you turn on post notifications so you don't miss any content from the channel. Now let's get into it and I'll see you on the next one. Up next, we have Dr. Doug Willen. We have Kristen here today and Kristen, what's your goal today? What do you want to work on? I just want to um, work on my neck, my shoulders, uh, my lower back. Um, I, do, I do work out and um, a lot of the times I'll have the bar resting on my shoulders, on my traps. Um, with deadlifts and squats, I feel like my um, my lower back gets very tight, um, and at times I do feel like I just get really bad headaches from a lot of neck pain. Touch your toes for a minute or get close. So that's you have a pretty good range of motion. Yeah, I do. Do you feel tightness in your lower back when you Absolutely. do that? Absolutely, without a doubt. So now you're touching there. Reach back and touch where in your back you feel it at the same time. Okay, so she's pointing here, turn around, and then stand up so we can see. So she's pointing, uh, turn this way. So you're feeling right in there, Absolutely, right? Absolutely, yeah, okay. a little higher. So is it okay if I adjust up into here? Yeah, you can. Just tell me to be loose because I have a really bad problem of always being tight all the time. Okay, <laughs> that's a good, good feedback, thank you. So I'm going to turn your head all the way this way. I'm going to reach under with my palm. And tilt, 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 tilt. Stay loose. Good breath in. Blow it out. Oh. Oh. oh, that feels amazing. And really drop the arms so oh. they really drape. Beautiful. So these are some of the other trigger points you have around the rhomboid major, the rhomboid minor. Like they're easy to find on you. I don't have to put your arm behind you to, to locate the, the one bad spot under your shoulder blade. For you, they pop out everywhere. They're so easy to see. Because they're so bad? Well, yes. So let's just, like a cat, I'm gonna walk down your back. Oh, did you hear it just pop? I did. Coming down the back. Coming down the back. Good. That's tight in there too, oh, right? Yeah. Oh my God. Sorry. That was a bad. <laughs> what do you think of that? Oh God, that felt so, it's just instant relief. It's absolutely instant relief. Big breath in and blow that out. So now I'm going to lift, may I lift this just sure. a few inches? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to lift it just to the bottom of your sure, ribs, that's fine. okay? Like four inches. Sure. Is that fine? Yep. I'm going to pull on the skin because I think this will be relaxing for you, okay? okay. Strange, but okay. relaxing. <laughs> so I'm going to pull the skin up like this. Okay. And this can come in really close to see this. Oh. Oh my God. What happened? I just felt. Just a, uh, uh, like a pop. Okay, let's do another one, all right? Nothing. Nothing. Oh. Uh, oh, my God. <sighs> what, what, what exact question? Oh, okay, so I'm going to try to grab just right above L4. Oh, my God. Oh my god. It feels it feels so much better. Good. Here's your hammies. Do you feel this right there? I do. That should hurt a little bit. Yes. Yeah, Cause 
you do a lot of weightlifting, so I want to make sure I'm looking at the hamstrings. Absolutely. And yesterday I did go on a 25-mile bike ride. <laughs> really? Yeah. And here's the calves. Oh, the calves are tight. Oh, sorry. I know, I'm horse. Good. Legs up like this. Mm -hmm. Does that bring on any tightness in the spine? Yes, I was just going to say that. Okay. Yep. Like right in there. Right? Um, I would say a little higher. Higher. Yep, yeah, right there. Okay, good. Thanks for letting yep, me know. Yep, right there. So I think what's happening is she's pointing to L4, and when I bring the legs up, the pelvis pitches forward, and it puts more pressure on L4. But since we're missing a little space there because of deadlift squats, all the power lifting that you do when you're working out like that, um, we need to open that up. Difference, okay? okay. That would be great, wouldn't it? Uh, I can't promise, but that's what, I'm, <laughs> that's, fine. that's what I'm visualizing. That's what I'm trying to get for you. Oh, my back just cracked now. <laughs> it did. So it's all, it really wants to do that. So here's L5, but I'm going to come up to L4. Actually, I might even do it like this. So I'm going to put my hand through, okay? Okay. So here's five, and there's four. Yeah, that's, that's the one, four. That's the one I want, right? Absolutely. That's the tender one. You feel the difference between four yeah, and five. Yeah, five feels relaxed. Yep. Four feels like a brick. Absolutely. Ah! Uh, uh, that felt that felt amazing. Okay, I'm gonna stay on L four. I'm just gonna really oh get it moving. Then we're gonna recheck the leg test, okay? Sure. You wanna do another one? Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna put my arm through, if I may. Yep. Let's get on that spot again. Hop your legs forward a little bit towards me. There you go. It's already coming. Yep, it's already going. Oh my God. Nice. So that felt absolutely amazing. So now nose down. You feel it already. Yeah, it's <laughs> already, it already softened up. So it should yeah, be a you, lot less. You feel it. Or it it's yeah. not even, it's non-existent. Yeah, so that's good. That's what we want. And the legs are even. Now you're going to lie on your back when you do a Y strap on sure. you, okay? And that, mm -hmm. I weigh it all today. <laughs> so first I'm going to let you experience the stretch to make sure it's not slipping off the back of your head. Mm -hmm. Does this feel okay for you? It feels fine. So what I do at the very end is I do a tug. Okay. So big breath in. Blow it out through your mouth. Oh my God. <laughs> wow. It's just so much looser. It's just so much looser. I don't feel like I even have that pain on my trap. It's just... I could finally touch it and it feels loose. It wasn't that agonizing pain when I first came in here. C1, C2, is, do you feel it? Yep. Big breath here. Pull it out. Ooh. Oh my God. I didn't even know all this was possible. <laughs> Pull a little on the leg now, okay? okay. You ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do this leg. Did you feel your ankle pop? I did, yes yeah. I did. <laughs> Absolutely. That one didn't go. I'm gonna contact a little higher. Sure. Oh yeah, that I felt. Good. Definitely. I think the toes are good. A little bit. So why why is that important to feel your ankle? Like. Well, cause you do a lot of um, lifting and probably burpees and. Yeah. So you're compressing your ankles. Got I just it. want to make sure they're open. Got it. Listen, I feel like a million dollars. <laughs> Stand here. Roll your shoulders a few times. 
so loose. So that's that one feels like there's a knife handle in your back. Yep. And yeah, right in there. Yeah. And now I'm going to come up to the top of the neck now mm -hmm. and just. Yeah, you're tight up here. So we're going to do an occiput lift again today. I'm going to have you sit here on the edge. Sure. So the first thing I'm going to do is get up here. I don't know if we'll get both sides, but we're going to try both sides. And let your head collapse like this. <laughs> nice. Oh, right thing. So the next thing I'm going to have you do is lie on your back. I just want to see if we can get it a different way. Sure. Because I still think it might be under here. So I'm going to do a supine occipital lift right in there. Let's see if we can get a little more. Got yeah. It. Did you hear that little yeah. baby one? Absolutely. But we needed that one. I'm going to put this around your ankle so we can stretch your lower back as we work. Sure. And I'm going to put the traction, flexion, distraction table that goes up and down to reloose, uh, loosen up the lower back. Okay. And I'm just going to raise the table so I don't hurt my back. Sure, no problem. <laughs> How many comments we hear them? So how about this spot here? Does that hurt right in there? It, that hurts, but also where your left, yeah, there you go. Okay. Oh my God, but that hurts. So I'm just on this one first, okay? And there too. Do you yep. feel that? Yeah. And there. Mm -hmm. So this whole panel is tight. Oh. It should kill. Oh, it does kill. <laughs> and you're, you're, it's all horrible up here too, mm -hmm. right? I feel like I just hold a lot of tension. That's one. I feel like you're sitting at a desk and you're always slouching. Yeah. You're sitting on the couch more often. Computer time. Yeah. A lot of people are on the computer more at home where they don't have as good a setup. Absolutely. You know. Right in there. Yeah. Head, uh, actually, I'm going to have you just take a big breath in, okay? <sighs> Got it. Nice. And just like instant. I, I honestly, I don't even feel the pain anymore over there. Here. I'm going to do that one next, okay? Big breath in and blow it out. There it is. Little one. I'm going to lift the shirt a little bit, okay? Yeah, sure. And that's where the L4 and the L5 are. Uh, well, a little lower. Okay. Got it. Oh. Big pop. Did you hear that one? Yeah. You needed that. That where your hand is now, I feel like it releases so much pressure, even on my front, even on the hips in the front. And I'm going to take this arm here and sit behind you, and I'm going to begin to twist your upper back. Okay. Mm -hmm. So pull this way. Here we go. Oh, squeeze your knees together. Oh. Got it. Did you hear a pop? Yeah. Good. So now put this arm up here, round the back a little bit, round is this way, oh. there you go. Ah. Oh my god. Big pop. <laughs> Let this go a little bit. Yeah. Big pop. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. Got it. I feel like you don't even have to pull it. <laughs> Can I grab the toe? Yeah. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> All right. My body definitely feels like like a world of a difference Great. so I mean that I could tell you so the cracking I feel like it was a little less than the first time because that was bad like that first time was bad <laughs> yeah well you had stuff that was embedded for, yeah for years yeah years yeah so I really felt like you the first time 
you really helped me, you know, just get that out, get all yeah. those kinks out. So it feels good. And now it's only been six weeks, yeah. which is time to just do another round. Yep, so absolutely. you're here and it's beautiful. Um, you know, maybe we'll have you come back in another six weeks. Absolutely. If anybody wants her to come back in six weeks, leave a comment <laughs> that we want to see Kristen again in six weeks because we enjoy your videos. So first I'm going to just make sure it's not pulling your ears out or anything. Is that okay behind your ears? Yep. So big breath in and blow it out and big breath in and we're going to do one now and blow it out. Oh yeah. Oh my God. Definitely. All the way to the, the shoulder. Good. Absolutely. So you still had some tension in there, you know, and that was what was coming out. I'm going to just see if there's last little bit in here that we can do. Mm. I really hold tension on my right side. Yeah, you really do. So let's do some other stuff. Stay there. I'm going to pull your arm up like this and put my hand into here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to lean across mm. and click that collarbone <sighs> in. Much looser. Yeah. Like, okay. <laughs> much looser. And we're going to do one more in here. Those are good. Let me go really low. Oh my God. Got one more out, right? Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Woo, good ones, right? <laughs> Absolutely. My wrists right. are bad. Yeah. Oh, you feel it? Yeah. Right there. Yep. Yeah. Oop, clunk, I just dropped no, our arm. Right. <laughs> all right, so would be equivalent to the psoas. And there's a tight spot here. Hobble your knee up towards your chest and put it back down. Good. No, it's killing me. That's the Holy bad spot, crap. yeah. So it is tight on you. Mm. I could just see that the way you're moving. And let's try the other side, okay? So bring this knee up. And it's okay if I push in mm -hmm. here? Ooh, do you see how that makes yeah. you jump? And put that knee down. Good. Squeeze your knees together. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. One more time. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Yeah. Did you feel it move yeah. a little bit? Yeah. And I feel like you just... Yeah, it releases a little bit. Okay. <laughs> yeah, because you're able to touch it, so you see the difference right away. Yeah, you didn't make you jump no. that time. Nope, no. If you made it to the end of the video, guys and girls, thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more.